Welcome to this 5G meditation where together we're going to practice grounding, letting go, guidance, gratitude, and grace. There are many ways that these 5Gs can be practiced. And here I'm going to share with you just one way. And so I invite you to use this meditation as a foundation for being able to discover how you can move through each phase of the meditation, each G, in your own unique way each time you practice. And so as we get settled in, I invite you to come into a comfortable position, sitting up on a chair with the feet flat on the floor or sitting on the floor up on a meditation cushion or on folded up blankets or towels. So the spine can be easily upright and the hips and knees can easily relax. Or you can also do this meditation lying down Find a position that allows you to be both awake and relaxed. And let's begin by taking a few slow, deep breaths. Feeling the breath traveling through the whole body. As you're breathing, allow there to be a sense of a string at the crown of the head, gently pulling the spine up into its tallest posture. And then let the body hang down from the string as though you're a marionette. As you're breathing here, feel where you're making contact with the ground or your chair. And let your points of contact with your seat spread out a little more to feel yourself arrive here, now, in this present moment. And now allow the breath to relax, letting it be more natural, but keeping your awareness on the breath as we enter our first phase of the meditation. We're gonna practice grounding by doing a scan of the body from top to bottom inviting relaxation to each part. And let it be just an invitation. So if the place where you're at in the body wants to stay tense, that's okay. We're just going to invite relaxation and practice relaxing with what is. And so let's bring our awareness and the breath to the forehead, inviting it to soften and spread. inviting the eyebrows to relax. Mm -hmm. 
and all the little muscles around the eyes. and deep into the eye sockets. Feel the cheeks, the jaw, and the tongue. Inviting relaxation to all these places Feeling the throat and the sides of the neck. Maybe even swallowing as a way of inviting relaxation. Feeling the shoulders from the inside out. The shoulder blades the collarbones and all the muscles around them. Inviting a feeling of letting go. Sensing the weight of the arms the elbows and the hands. Feeling where the hands are making contact with the legs and inviting them to spread out and soften even more. Sensing the breath in the chest, allowing the breastbone to rise and fall naturally. Feeling the breath in the armpits and the back of the ribs. Inviting all the muscles at the back of the ribs to soften. All the way down to the tailbone. Sensing the sides of the waist. and inviting the belly to soften and move freely with the breath. Softening through the pelvis and the hips. Inviting yourself to relax even deeper into your seat. Sensing the three dimensions of the legs, the knees, the calves, the feet, inviting the muscles to let go of their hold on the bones. And finally, feeling your connection to the ground. Let the ground support the body. And let the body relax into the ground.
And now let's move into our second phase, letting go. Use this feeling of the breath and this feeling of the body as your anchor, your home base as you open up the awareness to the whole of your experience. So notice the coming and going of sensations within the body. And also outside the body. The feeling of the air on your skin. Noticing the sounds around you. And noticing the coming and going of thoughts and emotions in the same way. So we open up to our whole field of awareness. And we notice how it's all constantly in motion, constantly changing, constantly evolving. Our wide open awareness is like the clear blue sky and all the thoughts, emotions and sensations are like clouds moving through it. We're not ignoring the clouds, but we're also not chasing them. And when you do notice that you've gotten pulled away by a cloud, or if the wide open awareness just feels too big, just kindly bring your attention back to the feeling of the breath and to the body here in this present moment, back to your anchor. And you can repeat this returning and anchoring process as many times as you need. And then, if you can, let the awareness open up once again to the whole of your experience.
instead of judging, analyzing, or problem solving, we just kindly and compassionately allow what's here to be here. Perhaps noticing things that have been hiding just below the surface, waiting to be noticed. And as we make room for everything, not grabbing hold of anything, we notice how it all just comes and goes and changes in a continuous flow. And now that we've opened up some, let's connect into our inner guidance. Tapping into our deep intuition and wisdom, we can ask, what do I need to be reminded of right now? This guidance can come in the form of sensations deep in the body or images or simple words. Just noticing what you sense right now as you tune into your inner guide. What do I need to hear right now? You could even ask a question, specific or general, big or small, and just listening in, feeling into the guidance you receive. Trust that this guidance will also reveal itself over the next days and weeks. And now let's come into our gratitude practice. Allow a recent memory to come into your awareness that allows the feeling of gratitude to naturally arise. 
It's great if it can be a memory of something that happened even earlier today or yesterday. It can be of something small and sweet or big and euphoric. And just allow that memory to fill your awareness. Let the feeling of that memory be felt in the body now. Breathe it in. And then let the memory of the event move into the background and keep the feeling in the body in the foreground. Keep breathing it in. And finally, Let's send out some grace. Allow the energy in the heart to grow, to expand, to radiate out. And send some energy from your heart to someone you know who needs it. It could be healing energy or strength, love or compassion. You could send it out to one person or to a group of people or to all beings. Sense this energy traveling from your heart outward to where you wish to send it. We're going to close our practice by rubbing the hands gently together, creating some heat, and then placing the hands on the heart or the belly or on the face, maybe giving yourself a hug. Feeling your body here, now. Feeling your breath. And we'll seal in the practice with a bow, either with the hands resting on the heart or press together at the heart and bowing towards yourself for taking the time to do this practice and bowing towards the power of the practice itself. Feel free to 
continue to sit here for as long as you like. And when you're ready, allow yourself to gently move into the rest of your day.